how to use choose function in microsoft excel hello everyone welcome to excel Ten tutorial in this function explain video series i'm going to explain how you can use choose function in microsoft excel i'm going to talk about the parameters and i'm going to talk about why you should use the choose function okay let's get started <music> The best way to learn a function is to apply it and in this tutorial I'm going to apply the choose function and while I am applying I will explain the parameters and I will explain how you should use it. Okay, so let's say we have a rating system here from 1 to 5, 1 being worse and 5 being awesome. Now we want to choose the value based on the rating. Okay, so if anyone gives the rating 1, it should show worse. If anyone gives the rating 5, it should display awesome. Okay, this is the simple task and I'm going to do it with choose function. Let's say we're going to display the result here and we're going to give the input in cell C1. Okay, so let's write the choose function equal to chwc you can see here it's suggesting and here goes the tool tips choose a value or action to perform from a list of values based on an index number okay so if you give the index number inside your choose function and it will find out the value according to that index number okay so double click here and the first parameter is index number so this is the input if you give it a index number one it will show the result worse okay if you give the index number two it will look for the second value okay now the index number indicates which value you want to select okay so as i'm going to write index number in cell c1 i'm going to select it here and if i press comma and it is asking for the value okay you can add a lot of values here and if i select value click here and select this one as the first value and i can press comma and select the second value or i can simply press ctrl and select all the values and the comma will be automatically placed okay now if i close parenthesis you can see here these are the values okay a1 a2 a3 a4 a5 these are the values and now index number is in c1 okay now if i write one in cell c1 it should display the result that is inside cell a1 because this is the first value so here you put the index number and the index number is starts from the first one one two three four five in this way okay now close the function it is showing the error message because i haven't selected the index number so i'm going to write here let's say i'm going to give it a rating five and if i press enter you can see here index number five displays the result awesome okay so if i change the index number from here to and press enter you can see this is the rating if i write three that means you literally choose what you want to display this is the choose function okay this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial if you can please support the channel from patreon and don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching